Hey everyone, I'm Mary, and this is going to be the daily mission search for the hidden ending that Bungie has said exists in the game. They said there's a, a certain endings in the daily missions that are different, and they give alternate rewards. They didn't say what kind of rewards. They might be exotic, but they also they're innocent exotics. So even though we've seen pictures of a few of them, so it might be just story content like with Cade, which I would actually be completely okay with. Or it would be something like the Super Black Shader, where you have to follow the quest line, and then you just get something cool-looking and legendary. I wouldn't mind if it was a Black Hammer-type uh, variant, because those were awesome legendaries. It's nice to have those equipped with exotics as well. In the meantime, today we got the Dreadnought. The first story mission from Taken King, where you actually got on the Dreadnought. I know, the name is a complete surprise there. Now, this one's interesting, because unlike a lot of the story missions in Taken King... I don't immediately feel they can be updated for Rise of Iron's secret mission, but at the same time, this one's special because it is you in there alone. So you have the entire area to work with, and there's no one to interfere with you. So if they make a change, it will only be seen when you're in the daily mission right now, which leads to a lot of possibilities. Uh, do I want to watch this? Oh yeah, I do. It's been, oh, actually, oh, wow, it's been months. Screw it, I'll watch it again. Now, the interesting part is... Oh, wow. I keep forgetting the inside of Airship ship actually looks really damn cool. Yep, that's still kind of freaky. I mean, we see bodies everywhere, but that's... Yeah. Hmm. Now, the places I think we need to check out on this are actually... See, this will actually be a little more difficult because you have almost the entire patrol map on this one to do, so this won't be the fastest one to check out, but if it's anything like either the Black Spindle or even some of the Sleeper missions, well, if it's like the Sleeper missions, it'll, it wouldn't count because those were unmarked until you had to find them. But if it's like the Black Spindle, at some point, we'll need to go to an area where there's a strike, but it'll be along the way. The places where we do that, at least easiest, would be probably the asylum section. Oh, that's why my light level's so low. Ah, okay, that, that makes a lot more sense. Ah. Kind of surprising it only lower my like seriously three thirty five I haven't updated that yet and just yeah, that'd be bad. So it's either a lead in to the strikes in here, which strikes, or Shield Brothers. Um, Shield Brothers will actually be the later one to check. Oh yeah, I don't want to use Blink either. I like it, but this isn't PVP. Mhm. Mm now let's switch these around. I don't really need anything too serious right now. It's probably better to switch into this now just so I have it. I like Cola Vance, but... No, 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 but I just like Cola Vance. It's good. Oh, wait. No. That's why. It might be a little less, but this thing. I just want to see how this compares. Just as a little side, I want to see how if we had the Gallahorn, it would have made this year easier. Ah, oh God. Still my favorite gun. I just... It's the Year 2 Iron Banner Scout Rifle, Colavance's Duty, and I just like it because it's solid and dependable. Now, since this is going to be a general search, I'm not going to go straight away into there. I want to check out some of these hidden sections in the back. When I say hidden, I mean in the literal sense that they're harder to find, not that there's anything there. Well, maybe. There's always this little doorway, which always struck me as odd. And they had a fragment back in here originally. Now, I have all the fragments because I have Beltane. Pretty sure I'm using that right now. So, that might have been the only thing they put in there. And I think it looks like they're keeping it that way. And just going to check the walls because they hit ghosts out there. Why not check other things? Thankfully, I can just uh, run along quickly. Jumping gives a better perspective. I don't see any holes in the wall I can jump into. 
Now, if it was this soon, that would have been kind of a buzzkill. Hmm. I wonder what a different ending here would look like. I don't see any platforms. Just the one you always know about where the ghost is. Also, if you don't have it yet, there's a ghost right there on that little uh, excretion of bone. Okay, excretion of bone makes it sound like he's shitting bone shards, but... Yeah, that, that kind of looks like what the ship's doing. So, no, that seems accurate. Ah, my super's almost full. Fun. Now, if I remember, there's going to be a wizard. I'm going to kill it. Yep, yeah, there's the wizard. Oh, yep. Uh, the upside, though, is that. That makes it so much easier than the first time around. And, like, literally, just let the thrall do all the work for you. And then you uh, kill it. See what I mean? It's just easy. Now, I always hated that little disappearing mechanic. Ugh. Okay. All the work for me. Yeah, that's exactly what it's doing. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Warlocks for the win. I thought it was not going to appear for a second there. Uh, that'd be bad. Now, of course, gotta check the doorway over here. Still is an opening, so it's not that. Oh, you can kind of see through it, sort of. Oh, yeah, there's another one up here, isn't there? Okay, for sheer shits and gills, I'm actually going to try and get there. Alley-oop. If I die, I die horribly and painfully. So you know it was worthwhile. Yes, because we got a horrible, painful death is how you know it's worthwhile. Which doesn't sound like something you'd say with Stockholm Syndrome at all. Mm -hmm. And we're in this little section of here. It says there's an enemy. Wait for it. Love the explosions. If nothing else, it's a good stun. Now let's see if scanning these things has any effect, especially in a daily... No. The disciples of Osiris believe ascended hive to be reborn in our realm when the time is right and with the sacrifice of huh. I should remember them talking about disciples of Osiris here. That's different. So it's not in here. Again, I'm also not sure if scanning might actually be a trigger. Now, I doubt it is, but I don't want to leave that unchecked just for the sake of completionist. Yeah, and honestly, I probably should have channeled, like, gone for a channel name called The Completionist because I'm a completionist asshole. And one second. Sorry about that. Allergies. Ooh, a little too far. That is a bridge too far for me, sir. Let's see if I can get over there. Oh, okay. A little too close to the edge. <laughs> oh, wow. And too far, too. I really lost my way. I guess I lost my way. If anyone gets the reference, I'm a huge anime geek, so kill a kill. Haha, <laughs> I didn't die. I mean, I knew that. I, I knew I wouldn't die. Yeah. Mm. All right. I do find it really funny, though, that we spent all this time in the Dreadnoughts searching for Oryx. Like, literally, there was an entire thing about we had to find where he is. It's it's right there. Just Yeah. He's in there the entire time. We literally crashed right next to him. Yeah. That's a thing. Like right now, if I could find some way to Titan jump over there. Just had to check because that would be something I would imagine Bungie. Theor oh, you, you, you are a bunch of people. I wonder if we could wall jump or wall climb high enough that we can get over to that platform. And then maybe 
Ooh, someone's really good at doing the Titan uh, buff jumps. See if you can make it over there. That would actually be really interesting. I'm not on a Titan right now, so I can't. I might try it later, though, just for shits and giggles. I mean, that's uh, pretty damn interesting. Hmm. It's probably the one place I cannot check out. But would definitely be... I mean, even just to see if you can, let alone... I mean, there might be a wall there for all I know. But if anyone's good at titan jumping, definitely try that. Like a titan wall jump with the sword and, you know, all the little buffs to jumping and whatnot. Wait, oh, there's the hole. I got a hole in one. I'm not even aiming. I'm just shooting you. Just put enough bullets down and you die. Hey, check this out. Boom. They just go so fast. It's like popping a pimple, except more murdery. That's a disturbing. Also, if anyone didn't have it, there's a fragment back here. Oh, wait. What am I checking for? I know I got it. Wait. No. Did I just get lost? I got lost in a corner. Congrats, Aria. You got lost on nothing. Feel proud about yourself. Ooh, hey, it appeared. Hive keep vital operations deep in the core of their architecture. You're Boom. Gonna get your hands dirty. <laughs> All right, now which way is the easiest? Um, I'm actually going to go that way just because I want to get to the court quicker in one second again. <sighs> Sorry about that. I just started moving everything out of my room, so all the dust that I hadn't been able to get to is just in the air now. And it's driving my allergies crazy. Allergies. I suggest never getting them. They're a terrible buy. Yep. Now let's go check out the court. And again, for anyone watching who is on the live stream and hasn't seen the beginning, I'm not entirely certain there's anything in this one. I'm mostly doing this for completionist's sake. That said... This is one of those odd areas where if they wanted to hide something in Taken King, this is completely doable because there's no open patrol section. This is a completely isolated daily, so it's completely doable. Oh, I love these lines. I'm just going to destroy this. Huh. That was easy. All right. Ooh, who's over here? Or over here? I see enemies. Uh, oh, there they are. Any others? What about over... Well, oh, that's just weird. Now, in the meantime, I'm just going to run down here. I want to see if there's any reactions. I don't believe there are. Okay, no, that, they haven't changed that. Good. That's still the poisony, methy stuff. Yes, methy. Very, very technical. What the fuck? There's a stream of interdimensional energy concentrated within that sphere. Well, oh, you've got to be kidding me! And something just stepped out. Okay, found something secret. Was not expecting that, but there is something secret here. Uh, okay, I'm going to cut this one here, and holy shit, I need to bring people in because I do not want to take on this guy by myself. I mean, was this already there? Because holy fuck, this is actually cool. Fanalock was my favorite one. <laughs> that is actually really fucking cool. Did they add that? <laughs> okay, so everyone watching, found something? No! Oh, you bastard. Aw, he disappeared. All right, so everyone, the court is open. Was not expecting that. Huh. Oh, crap knows. The output is consistent with my readings of the Shrine of Horus on the moon. Osiris believed all of the shrines were connected and went searching for their nexus. I think we found it. Did I tell you Osiris never returned? 
Huh. So, I had never seen that before. I mean, did anyone else... Like, was this in year two and I just never noticed the fact that you could fight Thanalok? <laughs> that is so freaking cool! I, I, I need to pull a fire team and see if we can actually take him down on his terms. That is so cool! Oh, that is... Okay, I'm just gonna make a quick edit to YouTube because... Oh shit, my system crashed. Ah, oh, no, no, no. Uh, Okay, so my computer crashed while I was actually doing something successful. Also, holy shit, they hid it in here? I'll, I'll be honest, I wasn't expecting that, but damn! No. That, that would help to talk if that was on. Secret confirmed. The Court of Orcs is open. And if you don't run away because, holy shit, Thanalox here. I wonder if it changes. Hmm. So, yeah. I mean, we could take out the wizards. Thanalok himself, that didn't do anything. Is that new? Oh, not again, damn it. Okay, my allergies are really bad today. I don't know what's up. I'm going to definitely come back after I check out the others because there was something there and that's just worth checking out. I wonder if I'll have any effect in the later sections. Um, I'm not going to bother getting to the jumping puzzle just because I hate those. If someone else wants to check it, be my guest. I will not be the one. Okay, I'm going to check the others to see if they bring up more things. Like, we only have one of them down so far. Ah, there's that headshot I want. Wait for it. Oh, Captain. Oh, there you are. Why did I not see you? I almost missed you too. Wow, I am missing all of you guys. I am so sorry. I need to give you the love and attention of bullets that you really deserve. Speaking of bullet! Bullets for everybody! Alloop. Is it dead yet? Oh, come on, you took a rocket to the face. Good. Stay that way. So yeah, I want to see... Okay, now that we know this one's good, I'm going to go back to the court, see if that triggers something else to open. Because this does seem like there's something to it. <laughs> yeah, the court is still uh, open for business, it seems. Uh-huh. Almost missed that jump. Waiting? Don't see anything. Oh, hey, there's some guys down here. Oh, you teleport. Oh, jeez, that was a big one. Kind of wish we could blink like... Oh, wait! Ha! Ah, we do blink like that. Alright, I'm going to go back to the opening spot and see if it respawns them for any chance. You, uh, going to oblige me, game? Just waiting. Nothing. Okay, nothing there yet. But they already reacted once, so I would think it's a surprisingly good chance they would do it again. Yeah, I'm so surprised that happened. I mean, holy shit, they actually changed something. I mean... Is it possible I've played this game for over a year and never saw that? Okay, if it is, make sure to comment down below because that is news to me. But I did not know the court would actually activate when you were in this mission. That is... 
So, Thanalok was my favorite one to fight. If I had a fire team in here, oh, so help me. I am going to do that. As long as there's some way to get that sword off him so we can actually damage him. Otherwise, he's completely invincible. No, I can't go that way yet. Where is the... Okay, ah, the last one's up here. So, yeah, um, did definitely find something new. Not sure if it plays into anything else, but... Oh, you didn't die? Seriously? Ah. Uh... Well, at least I'll take this one out quickly. Or maybe if I took all three of them out, then went to the court. Would that trigger it normally? Spooling down? Mm-hmm. You dead yet? Almost dead! Think that's all of them? Think that's all of them. Alright, now comes the fun part. Get to go check something. Which way is the court again? Let's go this way. I'm gonna go see if the court triggers something else. That was the intro side. There's the court. I'm gonna go around the normal side, see if that has any effect. Yeah, it's kinda of weird how we have to go down to get up and then it's bungee. All right, so will this re-trigger the court? Also, just wanted to check that these aren't working right now because that did seem to have a thing. It was kind of a thing. Just to go on and wait a second, see if it reopens. Maybe if you stagger Thanalock, that would have an effect. Oh God, if it's variable. Some of the other ones we don't need the sword to damage, so that might be a possibility. If anyone else wants to try this, apparently you do get to open Thanalock in this daily mission. Now, I didn't see his sword drop, so it might not be possible to kill him, but at the same time, just dropping him might have an effect on its own. In which case, cool shit! Okay, that's the wall I came from. That's probably where I want to go. Okay, the doors to the rest of the ship are closed. So I'll have to go this way and see if the doors on the inside are open as well. Hmm. Yep, yeah, Shield Brother Strike's the only one I can think of. And I'm pretty sure that's closed early on. So, before we drop the beacon, I'm going to run inside the ship and see if that has an effect. But yeah, I, I'm kind of surprised to find anything, and apparently Thanalok is in here. Yeah, that's the thing. If I had a fire team, so help me, I would drop his shield, see what happened. Maybe there would be some way to get a sword out for him. Ooh, that would be so freaking cool! You dead? There seems to be a lot of them. I know, surprise. Just gonna quickly check this little spot back here because I just want to see if they gave it a door. Okay, no door to darkness. Any treasury chests? No treasury chests. Dumb. I like the treasury chests. Hmm. All right. I'll check off the little passageways in the back in a second. Right now, I want to see if you could actually still move around in the back here. If I can sneak around to the other side of the ship. There's other little pathways that open up. And it's looking possible so far. It would have to be a pretty damn big door to cut this off. So we have... A pretty damn big door. Is it gonna open? You know, Ghost, the one time I would actually like you to open a door, you, you, you really kind of just drop the ball, man. Okay, not the one time. There's a lot of times where it's like, you know, your main function, as Eris said... In the Traveler's Last Dying Breath. 
she released Ghost to open doors. I know I'm badly quoting that, but let's be honest. That is pretty much all they did in year one. It was bad snark, which I'm actually okay with. I, I kind of like bad snark. It's a personal taste. Not everyone has it. And opening doors that had nowhere to go. It's like, hey, does this door go anywhere? No? Well, I can open it then. Okay, and this one's still closed. So apparently the one thing we found is that the Court of Orcs does open for you. Which is pretty awesome. Especially considering, you know, when you first came here, that was... I, I do not remember that being a possibility. And I'm almost certain there was a bunch of times I checked... Where the hell is everyone? I know I checked this more than a few times. Hmm. You dead yet? No? Ah, uh, here we go. Dude, he's just taking damage from the butt. He's getting shot in the butt. I don't know why that abuses me, but it does! I know, I'm trying to do the One Punch Man face. It no work. Twofer! Ah, uh, there was a third. All right, plant the beacon and take this thing down. We can't go anywhere else, but we did confirm there is something different here. Now, that's just... Oh, man, I want to take out the Hanalok now. I need to get a full fire team to do that. That'll be so freaking cool! So, yeah, uh, definitely something different confirmed. It isn't so much an ending secret, but it is something different that they changed. So, if you want to take out the Hanalok in the daily... If it's a different one every week, I don't know. That would actually be really cool and a nice little change. But yeah, that's a thing. I'll bring down some ammo crates from the ship. You're going to need them. Yeah, unfortunately, you don't drop the kind I like. Let's hit the back. This thing's going to die. Oh, God, it's almost dead. That was too close for comfort. Running to the side. Eh, nah, let's see how this works. Oh, it works well. Boom. <laughs> oh, that is oddly satisfying. Where are you, Ogre? No matter the method, Ogre! You have our thanks. Come on, let me kill it. Let me kill you. I just want to get your nice eye and make it a. St Ooh, there's a second Ogre. Second Ogre down. All right, gonna run down quickly, see if there's anything I'm missing. Just wanna pick this up in case the next mission has anything I want. Doubt it. Sometimes I wear it, I carry over ammo. All right, so no secret ending, but there was a secret little event they added into it because I am almost certain that didn't exist in the regular daily mission, which is actually freaking cool. I'm more than a little happy that there actually was something finally. Seriously, guys, uh, I'm grabbing a fire team next. I'm going to run in there and try and kill it. I don't think it will happen, but because you need the sword to take down him down to actually do damage, and the sword didn't spawn on that one guy. But all the same, it is so freaking cool that that actually worked. Ha! All right, thanks. All the same, guys. Thanks for watching. That was so freaking cool. Go ahead, try to kill that guy. If there's anything I'm missing, if you know a way to do it, or even if just the regular swords might have an effect because they're made from Crota Sword, I doubt Bungie would do that. It doesn't seem like it would be possible or non-dickish, so they won't do it. But all the same, that was so freaking cool. I'm a little happy. Not bad for the last full day I'm actually going to be here before I move out. Also, uh, moving out tomorrow. Tomorrow's my last regular live stream. After that, it will really depend on if I have internet. There is a connection, but I'm not sure it's fast enough to use dial-up. Which would be 
bad. So, if you don't see me after tomorrow, I'm getting internet. It'll probably be about a couple days to a week to see how long Comcast takes. Otherwise, yeah. That was so cool. Thanks again, everyone. Don't forget that subscriber button right there. Thanks for pressing it. If you haven't, no, thank you for pressing it. Seriously, guys, you guys are awesome. Good luck trying this guy out yourself. Later.